to destroy two days of hard work with one bite. Oh, that's exactly what I tried to tell her, Troy. You did? So why'd you give it to her, Bianca? I, uh, I was just testing her willpower. Oh, and I'm proud of you, Tara. You passed the test just fine. Come on, Tara. We'd better lead you away from temptation. Hardy pooper. You're not going to let that pie go to waste, are you? Definitely not. No, class. Let us all take our medieval history books and turn to page 66. Oh, how very odd. There's a slice of pizza in my day. A slice of pizza? Go on, Tara. Take a bite. Mmm. Mm. It's really quite scrumptious. No, no. I mustn't give in to temptation. And because of that, the English monarchy came crashing down. What in blazes? <laughs> Class dismissed. Up on this delicious, refreshing water. And not a calorie in a cooler full. Wow, what a splendid idea! I do believe I will. Wow, it's a chocolate shake! Well, Sean? Help yourself, Tara. You deserve a treat today. Looks like Tara's really going full out to qualify for that Miss Magnolia contest. Yes, exercising wherever she goes. Maybe some television will take my mind off food. Tired of the same old boring menu? Then come on down to Mamma Mia's Pizzeria and try our new Mile High Pizza Sandwich. Oh, I believe I'd give my autograph picture of Robert E. Lee for just one bite of that delectable looking thing. But wait, there's more. Like our spaghetti specialissimo. Tender strands of pasta smothered in mouth-watering meat sauce. Oh, my. Mmm, doesn't that look good? It most certainly does. Please, I've simply got to have some. So hurry on down to Mamma Mia's Pizzeria, now. She really 
might be overdoing this exercise bit. The Miss Magnolia contest is only a few hours away, so we must act quickly. Oh, I don't know, Bianca. I still don't think it's right to do this. But don't you understand, you silly goose? We're doing this for Tara's own good. We are? Don't you see? If she does win in this Magnolia contest, it will probably make her vain, self-centered, and arrogant. Huh. Just like you. Exactly. And you wouldn't want that, would you? Oh, gosh, you are a good friend. Of course I am. Now remember, I want you to buy every single thing in that bakery. Don't worry, my pet. I'll leave no macaroon unturned. Well, Tara, in just a few minutes, you'll be on your way to becoming the next Miss Magnolia. Tell us, Miss Bell, how does that make you feel? Hungry enough to swallow a swamp full of muskrats without even chewing. Don't sweat it, Tara. You'll get all the food you want after the contest. Right now, you'd better hurry up and put that dress on. Right. See y'all later. If I still have the strength. It shouldn't take but a minute to get... Jumping June bugs. Oh, no. I do believe I've died and gone to heaven. Give in now. Not after all I've been through. Don't fuck the sweetie pies, sweetie pies. out of that contest. <laughs> Better luck next year. Oh, no! What have I done? The only contest I could enter now is the Kentucky Derby. And I don't mean as a jockey. No, no, I can't. No! But you know the rules, Tara. You have to weigh in to qualify. Don't sweat it. Like, I'm sure you dropped enough pounds to make it. that would happen. <laughs> they? Who is they? The people over at the Skinny Mini Bake Shop. The Skinny Mini Bake Shop? Bubble Brain Bean Bag! A diet bakery. Nothing in there is over one calorie! <laughs> I know. That's why I love shopping there. Mondo Mountain of Munch go to waste. In the program you just saw, Tara tried to lose weight in a very dangerous and unhealthy way, and for a very silly reason. 
before you make any decisions about how much you should weigh or how to gain or lose weight, always check with a doctor. Losing weight is not something to be taken lightly.